using divisible t rule check whether the following numbers are divisible by 6 a number is divisible by 6 the number is divisible by 2 and 3 we collect the divisible t rule of 2 a number is divisible by 2 the digit in one's place is 2 or 4 or 6 or 8 or 0 now first number 198 write the places one place, tenth place, hundred place. In 198, the digit in one place is 8. So 198 is divisible by 2. Now, divisible T rule 3, sum of digits. In 198, sum of digits is equal to 1 plus 9 plus 8, which is equal to 18. 18 is divisible by 3. So, 198 is divisible by 2 and 3. So 198 is divisible by 6. Next number 9915. Write the places. One place, tenth place, hundred place, thousand place. In 9915, the digit in one place is 5. So 9915 is not divisible by 2. So even if 9915 is divisible by 3, it will not be divisible by 6. Why? Because divisible T rule 6 says that the number should be divisible by 2 and 3. This number is not divisible by 2. So we need not check the divisible T rule of 3 for this. We can directly say that 9915 is not divisible by 6. Next number 25,690. Write the places. One place, tenth place, hundred place, thousand place, ten thousand place. In twenty five thousand six hundred ninety, the digit in one place is zero. So twenty five thousand six hundred ninety is divisible by two. Now check the divisible T rule of three. In twenty five thousand six hundred ninety, sum of digits is equal to two plus five plus six plus nine plus zero, which is equal to twenty two. Twenty two is not divisible by three. Now, 25,690 is divisible by 2, but it is not divisible by 3. So, 25,690 is not divisible by 6. Next number, 53,256. Write the places, 1th place, 10th place, 100th place, 1000th place, 10,000th place. In 53,256, the digit in one place is 6. So, 53,256 is divisible by 2. Now, check the divisible T rule of 3. In 53,256, sum of digits is equal to 5 plus 3 plus 2 plus 5 plus 6, which is equal to 21. And 21 is divisible by 3. So, 53,256 is divisible by 2 and 3. So, it is divisible by 6.